Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 175 80ths R13 to 185 80ths R13. First up, fitment. The diameter difference between these tire sizes is 2.6%, which falls within the acceptable 3% range. This means the interchange is technically acceptable without necessitating major adaptations. Now, let's talk about the tire height. Switching to the 185 80ths increases the diameter by 0.63 inches, which in turn raises the vehicle's ground clearance slightly. This increase could provide a bit more clearance over obstacles and rough roads, although it might slightly affect handling by raising the center of gravity. The 185 80ths is 0.39 inches wider than the 175 80ths. This increase in width results in a larger contact patch, which could potentially improve traction and stability. However, it may also lead to slightly increased rolling resistance. Switching to the 185 80ths increases the sidewall height by 0.31 inches. The larger sidewall height could result in a slightly softer ride and better impact absorption compared to the smaller sidewall of the 175 80ths. This might be noticeable on rougher roads or off-road conditions. With the larger 185 80ths tires, the speedometer will read slightly lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 miles per hour, the actual speed will be 20.52 miles per hour. This difference is relatively small but important to note for maintaining accurate speed readings. Based on our observation, Switching to 185 80ths offers benefits such as potentially improved traction and stability due to the wider contact patch, slightly increased ground clearance, and a marginally softer ride due to the taller sidewall height. These changes could be beneficial for those seeking better performance on rough roads or looking for a slightly more comfortable ride. However, there are some shortcomings to consider. The wider tires may lead to slightly increased rolling resistance, which could marginally affect fuel efficiency. The raised center of gravity, although minimal, might have a small impact on handling characteristics. Additionally, the speedometer inaccuracy, while small, should be taken into account for precise speed management. These changes are minor but could be significant depending on your driving conditions and preferences. Always ensure compatibility with your vehicle specifications before making a switch.